this was my third visit to Oak Glen, California. My drive to Oak Glen, California began in the fog and ended in sunshine straight out of a postcard. Oak Glen is 80 miles from Los Angeles and 65 miles from my hometown of Orange, California. It is a small community in the foothills of the San Bernardino Mountains. Oak Glen has one central road that starts from Interstate 10 in Yucaipa and ends at Interstate 10 in Beaumont, California. This was the third time I visited this place. My first stop was the super cute Parish Pioneer Ranch. This is the real deal. The orchard on the property dates back to 1867. Their barn features apples, apple butter, apple cider, gourmet chocolates and candy, wines, souvenirs, basically the stuff that dreams are made of. And I got an apple burrito for myself. The whole stretch of Oak Glen Road travels 20 miles as it winds through beautiful, agriculturally rich valleys. This was my first time visiting Snowline Orchard, and I am so glad that I did. Snowline Orchard is a family-owned apple farm, winery, and cidery founded in 1898. They are the only place in Oak Glen where you can get apple cider donuts, which is made with their own apple cider, and I bought a dozen. Just as Snowline is the only place in town where you can get apple cider donuts, the Wilshire Apple Shed is the only place where you can get pizza. This was my first time to this wonderful place. According to their website, they are a unique destination filled with the charm of yesteryear. The Wilshire's Apple Shed was the very first roadside stand in Oak Glen. Visit us to experience gourmet wood-fired pizza, specialty coffees and teas, mercantile gifts, cigar humidor, and hard cider all in a quiet country atmosphere. And the Wilshires were the original pioneers of the area when they purchased 3,000 acres in 1871. I got the market-to-market -market pizza to take home, and I did enjoy it. My next stop was the Oak Glen Preserve. This was also my first time. The preserve is located at an elevation of 5,024 feet, and it sits below the 8,700-foot Wilshire Peak, and it features a botanic garden. Vintage farming equipment like plows and sows are on display. My first visit to Oak Glen was a meetup I hosted for the Apple Butter Festival. I drove a carpool of people, and it was snowing, but unfortunately it was overcrowded. After that, I vowed to do it right the next time. Last year, in 2020, I went super early and it was great. The pandemic probably helped too. This year, I also went early and it was also great. And here, numerous species of pine tree were on display, including Douglas firs. And all the bells on earth shall ring on Christmas Day, on Christmas Day. And all the bells on earth shall ring on Christmas Day. There was an optional loop to hike to an amazing view, but I cheated and opted to fly my drone instead. On Christmas Day in the morning And all the 
And there are giant sequoia trees. And then there was Los Rios Rancho, the original packing barn which stood for 115 years and the store barn which goes back to the 1940s burned down on October 2nd of 2020. A new barn is planned to open in 2023. If you enjoyed this video, please, please hit that thumbs up button. Please subscribe to this channel if you're not already subscribed and have a magical day.